Mastery by Sarah Teasdale Read for LibriVox.org by Algie Pug, Perth, Western Australia I would not have a God come in To shield me suddenly from sin And set my house of life to rights Nor angels with bright burning wings Ordering my earthly thoughts and things Rather my own frail guttering lights Wind-blown and nearly beaten out Rather the terror of the nights A long sick groping after doubt Rather be lost than let my soul Slip vaguely from my own control Of my own spirit let me be In soul though feeble mastery End of poem Mastery by Sarah Teasdale Read for LibriVox.org by Anita Slusser I would not have a God come in To shield me suddenly from sin And set my house of life to rights Nor angels with bright burning wings Ordering my earthly thoughts and things Rather my own frail Guttering lights, wind-blown and nearly beaten out, Rather the terror of the nights, And long, sick, groping after doubt, Rather be lost than let my soul Slip vaguely from my own control, Of my own spirit let me be, In soul, though feeble, mastery. End of poem Mastery by Sarah Teasdale Read for LibriVox.org by Alan Wayman I would not have a god come in To shield me suddenly from sin And set my house of life to rights Nor angels with bright burning wings Ordering my earthly thoughts and things Rather my own frail guttering lights Wind-blown and nearly beaten out Rather the terror of the nights, and long sick groping after doubt, Rather be lost than let my soul slip vaguely from my own control. Of my own spirit let me be, in soul though feeble, mastery. End of poem. This recording is in the public domain. Mastery by Sarah Teasdale, read for LibriVox.org by Beth Mullet. I would not have a god come in to shield me suddenly from sin and set my house of life to rights, nor angels with bright burning wings ordering my earthly thoughts and things. Rather, my own frail guttering lights, wind blown and nearly beaten out, rather the terror of the nights and long sick groping after doubt. Rather be lost than let my soul slip vaguely from my own control. Of my own spirit let me be in soul, though feeble, mastery. End of poem. This recording is in the public domain. Mastery by Sarah Teasdale Read for LibriVox.org by Betty W. I would not have a god come in to shield me suddenly from sin and set my house of life to rights, nor angels with bright burning wings ordering my earthly thoughts and things, rather my own frail guttering lights, wind blown and nearly beaten out, rather the terror of the night and long sick grouping after doubt, rather be lost than let my soul Sleep vaguely from my own control. Of my own spirit let me be, In soul the feeble mastery. End of poem. This recording is in the public domain. Mastery by Sarah Teasdale Read for LibriVox.org By Capricia Page I would not have a god come in To shield me suddenly from sin And set my house of life to rights Nor angels with bright burning wings Ordering my earthly thoughts and things Rather 
my own frail guttering lights, wind-blown and nearly beaten out. Rather the terror of the nights and long-sick groping after doubt. Rather be lost than let my soul slip vaguely from my own control. Of my own spirit, let me be in soul, though feeble mastery. End of poem. This recording is in the public domain. Mastery by Sarah Teasdale. Read for LibriVox.org by Claudia Salto. I would not have a God come in to shield me suddenly from sin and set my house of life to rights, nor angels with bright burning wings ordering my earthly thoughts and things. Rather my own frail guttering lights, wind blown and nearly beaten out. Rather the terror of the nights and long sick groping after doubt. Rather be lost than let my soul slip vaguely from my own control. Of my own spirit let me be in soul, though feeble mastery. End of poem. This recording is in Mastery by Sarah Teasdale. Read for LibriVox.org by David Lawrence. I would not have a God come in to shield me suddenly from sin and set my house of life to rights. Nor angels with bright burning wings ordering my earthly thoughts and things. Rather my own frail guttering lights wind-blown and nearly beaten out. Rather the terror of the nights and long sick groping after doubt. Rather be lost than let my soul slip vaguely from my own control. Of my own spirit let me be in soul, though feeble, mastery. End of poem. This recording is in the public. Mastery by Sarah Teasdale. Read for LibriVox.org by Ernst Patinama. I would not have a god come in to shield me suddenly from sin and set my house of life to rights nor angels with bright burning wings ordering my earthly thoughts and things rather my own frail guttering lights wind blown and nearly beaten out rather the terror of the nights and long sick groping after doubt rather be lost than let my soul slip vaguely from my own control of my own spirit let me be in soul though feeble mastery end of poem this recording is in the public domain mastery by sarah teasdale read for librivox.org by ellie in may 2013 i would not have a god come in to shield me suddenly from sin and set my house of life to rights no angels with bright burning wings ordering my earthly thoughts and things rather my own frail guttering lights wind blown and nearly beaten out rather the terror of the nights and long sick groping after doubt rather be lost and let my soul slip vaguely from my own control of my own spirit let me be in soul to feeble mastery end of poem this recording is in the public domain Mastery by Sarah Teasdale. Read for LibriVox.org by Jason Mills. I would not have a god come in to shield me suddenly from sin and set my house of life to rights, nor angels with bright burning wings ordering my earthly thoughts and things, rather my own frail guttering lights, wind blown and nearly beaten out. Rather the terror of the nights and long sick groping after doubt, rather be lost than let my soul slip vaguely from my own control. Of my own spirit let me be, in soul though feeble, mastery.
This audiobook is brought to you by Full Audiobooks. Please like, subscribe, and click the bell icon if you love audiobooks. Mastery by Sarah Teasdale, read for LibriVox.org, by Jenny Meisberger, Gig Harbor, Washington. I would not have a god come in to shield me suddenly from sin and set my house of life to rights nor angels with bright burning wings ordering my earthly thoughts and things rather my own frail guttering lights wind-blown and nearly beaten out rather the terror of the nights and long sick groping after doubt rather be lost than let my soul slip vaguely from my own control of my own spirit let me be in soul though feeble mastery end of poem this recording is in the public domain mastery by sarah teasdale read for LibriVox.org by Leanne Howlett. I would not have a god come in to shield me suddenly from sin and set my house of life to rights, nor angels with bright burning wings ordering my earthly thoughts and things, rather my own frail guttering lights, wind-blown and nearly beaten out, rather the terror of the nights and long sick groping after doubt, rather be lost than let my soul slip vaguely from my own control of my own spirit let me be in soul though feeble mastery end of poem mastery by sarah teasdale read for librivox dot org by lucretia b i would not have a god come in to shield me suddenly from sin and set my house of life to rights nor angels with bright burning wings ordering my earthly thoughts and things rather my own frail guttering lights wind-blown and nearly beaten out rather the terror of the nights and long sick groping after doubt rather be lost than let my soul slip vaguely from my own control of my own spirit let me be in soul though feeble mastery end of poem mastery by sarah teasdale read for librivox dot org by leonard wilson of springfield ohio I would not have a god come in to shield me suddenly from sin and set my house of life to rights, nor angels with bright burning wings ordering my earthly thoughts and things, rather my own frail guttering lights, wind blown and nearly beaten out, rather the terror of the nights and long sick groping after doubt, rather be lost than let my soul slip vaguely from my own control of my own spirit let me be in soul though feeble mastery mastery by sarah teasdale read for librivox dot org by paul Wisunder. i would not have a god come in to shield me suddenly from sin and set my house of life to rights. Nor angels with bright burning wings ordering my earthly thoughts and things. Rather, my own frail guttering lights, wind-blown and nearly beaten out. Rather, the terror of the nights and long, sick, groping after doubt. Rather be lost than let my soul slip vaguely from my own control. Of my own spirit let me be, in soul, though feeble, mastery. End of poem. Mastery by Sarah Tisdale. Read for LibriVox.org by Ratan Deeps at once sing, India. I would not have a god come in 
to shield me suddenly from sin and set my house of life to rights nor angels with bright burning wings ordering my earthly thoughts and things rather my own frail guttering lights wind blown and nearly beaten out rather the terror of the nights and long sick groping after doubt rather be lost than let my soul slip vaguely from my own control of my own spirit let me be in soul though feeble mastery mastery by sarah teasdale read for librivox dot org by ruth golding i would not have a god come in to shield me suddenly from sin and set my house of life to rights nor angels with bright burning wings ordering my earthly thoughts and things rather my own frail guttering lights wind-blown and nearly beaten out rather the terror of the nights and long sick groping after doubt rather be lost than let my soul slip vaguely from my own control of my own spirit let me be in soul though feeble mastery End of poem. This recording is in the public domain. Mastery by Sarah Teasdale. Read for LibriVox.org by Raven Notation. 2013. RavenNotation.wordpress.com. I would not have a god come in to shield me suddenly from sin and set my house of life to rights nor angels with bright burning wings ordering my earthly thoughts and things rather my own frail guttering lights wind-blown and nearly beaten out rather the terror of the nights and long sick groping after doubt rather be lost than let my soul slip vaguely from my own control of my own spirit let me be in soul, though feeble, mastery. End of poem. Mastery by Sarah Teasdale. Read for LibriVox.org by TechSavvy. www.techsavvy.wordpress.com I would not have a god come in to shield me suddenly from sin and set my house of life to rights nor angels with bright burning wings, ordering my earthly thoughts and things, rather my own frail guttering lights, wind-blown and nearly beaten out, rather the terror of the nights, and long sick groping after doubt, rather be lost than let my soul slip vaguely from my own control, of my own spirit let me be in soul through feeble mastery. End of poem. This recording is in the public domain. Mastery by Sarah Teasdale Read for LibriVox.org by Zainab on 29th April 2013, Dubai I would not have a god come in To shield me suddenly from sin And set my house of life to rights Nor angels with bright burning wings ordering my earthly thoughts and things, rather my own frail guttering lights, wind-blown and nearly beaten out, rather the terror of the nights and long sick groping after doubt, rather be lost than let my soul slip vaguely from my own control. Of my own spirit let me be, in soul though feeble mastery. End of poem. This audiobook is brought to you by Full Audiobooks. Please like, subscribe, and click the bell icon if you love audiobooks.